Hello Kids Play Church, it's me Miss Lisa back with another mini teaching. Today we're going to be talking about giving thanks. We're going to open up our Bibles and go to Psalms 106 1, and it says, Praise the Lord. Give thanks to the Lord because he is good. His faithful love continues forever. This Bible verse reminds me to give God thanks and praise him for simply loving me. Sometimes I got to think back and think, man, there was times in my life where I searched and searched for acceptance and love from other people. But I know that I can always go back to God and and seek him and knowing that he's going to faithfully love me, like faithfully, no matter what, no matter what we do, whenever, no matter what we say, we can always go back to God and find that purpose that he's given us in our life. And one of the main purposes that God created us is to simply love him. God loved and he wanted love back and so i can always rely and go back to god and know that he's going to comfort me and just wrap me in this warm blanket of love have you ever like gone through life and or gone through a time in your life where you felt like if man i don't feel good about myself or i don't have any friends or someone was mean to me or i didn't feel accepted in class or anything, any kind of little simple way or any kind of way that you felt like you were not received by a person. Well, sometimes we go through those seasons. But for me, I can always rely on going back to God and finding that comfort and knowing that God doesn't want us to be perfect. He doesn't need us to go and show him how great we are. Like if whenever you're little and you have a test and you're like, you work really hard on that test and then you make a good grade and you just want to go run back to your parents and say, look what I did, look what I did. Well, God, he does see us go through tests at times, but he's not really looking for the great things that we did. But for us, it's just simply relying on him and relying on his love. That's all he really wants is for us to seek him diligently and seek him and see that our hearts are just longing for that love and acceptance from him. And there's no test that we have to prove that we're good enough for him. He just wants us to come. He just comes and he has his arms wide open to receive us. Well, I hope that that blessed you and I hope that you always know that you're loved perfectly by God no matter what. And there's no need to be perfect. He's just gonna receive you and then he'll, he'll lead you and guide you on the way to go. Okay, bye.